Hi there, Nick Riggs, Arnold Rendering Specialist at Autodesk. I just want to show how to use the AOV Write RGB shader in combination with the Utility shader to write out an object ID pass. There is this written tutorial with a scene file if you want to follow along. So the recommended way of creating object masks is through the Cinema 4D tag Arnold Object Mask. And I put a link in the description to that video. So I've got some objects here that I want to create an object ID pass with. Start off by creating a new node material and then create the AOV write RGB. Connect the output to the shader, the Arnold material, and then create a standard surface shader for our shading. Connect that to the pass through of the AOV write RGB and then create a utility shader, which we'll use for object IDs. Connect that to the AOV input of the AOV write RGB. And then for the utility, just make sure the shade mode is set to flat for the mask. And the color mode is set to object ID. And then in the AOV write RGB, under the AOV name, we'll give it a name like object ID. Okay, and then just assign that to the objects. And if we go to the render settings and under the AOVs tab of the Arnold Min settings, we can create a custom AOV. So add a custom AOV and then give it the same name that we used for the AOV right RGB shader, so object ID. Okay, and then we can see our object ID custom AOV and also in the object manager here. So let's start off an Arnold IPR render. So there's our standard surface shader. And then under the AVs, we can see the object ID there. What if we want the same object ID for both of the spheres? Well, we can add an Arnold parameters to the node group. So it's in the 4D tags, Arnold parameters. And under the user options, we can give it a, an ID number. So something like ID space one. I we'll have to click in the IPR to refresh it. Now we can see both spheres share the same ID number and ID color because this is using the same parameters tag on the group. Okay, so that's how to use the AOV Write RGB shader in combination with the utility shader to create some object IDs. Okay, thanks for watching and bye for now.